To install the Profile Performance interior illumination strips, first remove the side panel to access the screws for the headlight switch panel. Remove the two T15 Torx screws and pop off the headlight switch panel. Now using a voltmeter, test the wiring to find the parking light wire. Strip back the factory conduit. As you can see in this 2021 GMC Sierra, it is the yellow wire on the top of this plug. Now you can unwind your inline fuse harness, cut off the ring terminal, and strip back the wire. Next, strip back the OEM parking light wire and splice in the fuse wire. Solder the joint and apply electrical tape to protect the connection. Reinstall the factory conduit and go over with electrical tape as well. Next, run the fuse harness through the dashboard down to the footwell. Grab the ground wire ring terminal and remove this 10 millimeter bolt in the dash. Install the ring terminal over the bolt and reinstall it. Now you can reinstall the headlight switch panel. Now you can grab your Profile Performance RGB controller. Remove the side panels with a Phillips head screwdriver. Grab the GST adapter, loosen the four flathead bolts on the terminal of the controller and insert the wires. Tighten the terminals referencing the wire designated on the sticker. Reinstall the side panel, making sure to position the grommet correctly. Next, grab the wires from the fused harness and strip back the wires. Loosen the flathead bolts on the terminal and insert the wires. Tighten the terminals again, referencing the polarity according to the sticker. Don't forget to reinstall that side panel. It should look something like this. Next, grab one of your footwell lighting strips and plug it into the controller. Now grab your RGB profile remote. Open the battery tray and insert the battery with the positive terminal facing the back side of the remote. Next, set your headlights to parking lights and press the power button on the remote. Be sure to test all the functions and colors. Now you can route the strip to the footwell area and use some zip ties to secure it. Now you can move to the passenger side. You're going to have to remove this bottom tray to pass the wires through. Run the wires across and plug it in to test if the strip is working properly. For this side, we're going to use the double-sided tape on the back of the strip. Start by grabbing some isopropyl alcohol and wiping down the metal strip underneath the glove box. Remove the backing from the LED strip and attach the LED strip in place. Press down firmly to make sure you have good contact. Using zip ties, secure the remaining wires for an OEM finish.